morning everyone today is friday so this is what i'm wearing today this is just a really big baggy white um like really thin jumper from asos got a vest top on underneath and i'm then wearing my light blue mum jeans or mom jeans however you want to say it um which are from topshop i love these they're so comfortable and they always look really nice on um so yeah it's kind of a bit of a laid back outfit but really comfy and it still looks you know all right so there's that um as i said i'm not going out this morning i'm going out um around lunchtime it's currently 20 to 11. i've done my makeup i've got dressed i've put washing in i've emptied the dishwasher i've gone through bags for charity all that kind of crap i've had quite a productive morning so far um, and I'm now just getting ready to film a video. So I'm going to um, film my January and February favourites, which are just on the bed there. Um, so yeah, there's also a couple of bits that I want to do in this video today, um, mainly for my own benefit, I'm not going to lie. Uh, well, one of them is anyway. I want to go through some of the things that I bought last weekend when my friend was up and it was my birthday. I did a little bit more shopping than I normally would do so I thought I'd just kind of run through those and do a haul so I'll do that later on as this afternoon and then the other thing I want to do is a room tour um, now this I want to do for myself I wanted to do it as a main channel video but it is just the one room I still live with my parents and I don't want to show the entire house so I thought for one room I don't want to go through any of my drawers or anything so like a whole video on that is a little bit intense so I'm going to add it into this video, I'm going to film that later as well um, and I'll explain why and everything when it comes to filming it. But for now I'm going to watch some YouTube, I'm going to get this mop straightened. Um, it's the first time I've straightened my hair in ages because I didn't like it straight when it was the old length. So it's the first time I'm going to be straightening it when it's this length. This is the shortest I've had my hair in like 10 years. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get this straightened and then I'm going to get everything set up and I'm going to film. So. See you on the flip side. There we go, all straight. Um I think I prefer it straight this length. Um, before I didn't have like a little fringe cut in, like I've got a little thing here going on and um, it wasn't quite as thin on the ends and because it was longer it just looked, I don't know, weird. Whereas now I think it, it looks quite nice, it kind of goes around my face a little bit more. Um, so yeah, I'm going to finish up watching this vlog, I think it's got like a minute left on it. And then I'm going to get everything set up for filming and then I'll show you kind of my setup and everything before I get started. So let's, let's do that. Oh, I'm not even in focus. Thanks camera. Thanks. Right, so I'm all set up. This is like my setup for filming, I guess. It's super duper simple. Um, I use natural light. I don't have a light at the moment. Um, I don't think that's going to be something I get until I move house and stuff. So what I do is I set up all of these boxes here so that my camera is at the right angle. Um, and then my camera is on like a little tripod. I don't know if you can see in the mirror. But there's like this thing on the bottom. Um, and then this is my chair that I use. It's actually my dressing table chair, but I just kind of flip it around for when I'm filming. There are all the bits that I'm going to be talking about. And then this is my backdrop. So it goes onto my bed. And then that is my, like, I don't know, like bookshelf area. And I'm going to crack on with filming now because I need to leave soonish. So yeah, I will see you in a little bit. Right, the lighting's really orange. I do apologise. Um, I also apologise if you roll around a little bit like this. I just put you on like a big tripod. Um, and the tripod is not as big as I thought it was. So I'm like, I'm carrying it still. And it's not very secure at the top. So I apologise if you wobble. Um, but basically... I'm just going to do the room tour now. It's still the morning. I haven't had lunch. I've gone to work or anything yet. But I kind of want to spend my afternoon both editing and, if I can, filming another video for next week. So while I've got the time, I just figured I may as well do it now. Now, I said I was going to explain why I wanted to do this um, now um, when I came to filming it. So I will do very quickly. 
we are moving house. Um, my grandparents need to move in with us and the house that we're in at the moment will not fit us all. So we basically just need to move house into a bigger one to fit us all better. Um, I have lived in this house for 20 years, just over. So this is basically the house that I grew up in. I'm 23 now. Um, I don't really remember any of the houses. This has always been my house. Um, and it is a little bit sad that we're going, but I'm also quite excited because I've never, other than when I moved to uni, I've never lived anywhere else. Um, so it is a little bit exciting to kind of start new um, while I still need to live with my parents anyway. Obviously I'll be doing that again when I move out. But for now, I do still need to live with my parents and this is just how it is really. So I wanted to do a room tour because next week they're coming to put our house on the market, which means I need to put a lot of my personal items away. Um, as you'll see when I walk around, there's a lot of like little knick-knacky bits. So I just wanted to kind of go through my room and film it. It is for my own personal benefit, so that I can look back on it in a few years and remember what my room used to be like at this time in my life. I kind of wish I'd done this every time we needed to change my room or anything like that. But, you know, I just thought it'd be nice to have this one and kind of see what it was like. So I've also noticed that you guys are really nosy. <laughs> like the video that has the most views on my channel is my what's in my bag. Um, so, I mean, I'm nosy too. There's nothing wrong with it. So I just thought I'd kind of go around and show you because I thought you guys might like it as well um, as myself rather than me just kind of keeping it private, like, or whatever. So I'm going to stand behind the camera. Wobble, wobble. So this is my room. Um, on the door, it says Hannah's room. If you didn't know, my name isn't um, Caitlin. That's my middle name. Hannah is my first name. And this has been on my door since I can remember. Um, so then you walk into my room and... And kind of the first thing that you see is my bed. So very quickly, this is just what my room looks like when you walk in through the door. So I'll take you down this side first. So down this side of my room, there's like a chest of drawers here and then there's all of my bookshelves that go down. Um, so in these drawers, there's just things like scarves and coats and things. It's also then where I keep all my Jo Malone boxes. This is a new water bottle I got last week that says, I can't run, I'm a mermaid. So yeah, really like that. But um, yeah, they're bits that kind of need a place to live but don't have a place to live yet. So that's what those are. And then as you come down here, I've got my very wilted birthday flowers. Um, these I got last week and they're just kind of starting to die a little bit, but they're still nice and bright. So they're still living there. I've then got my pop figures. So I've got Aurora, Belle, a little aerial figurine. And then I've got Dorothy and Belle. I've then got two photo frames here. Um, the one at the back obviously needs filling and the one at the front is me and my two best friends um, at their, well, at Yanni's wedding. Um, it's one of my favourite pictures so I just have that framed there. I've then got these drawers here which are magnified, look, you can see the camera. <laughs> um, and they've just got like random bits and pieces in like jewellery and stuff. I've then got my collection of space form glass. I love these, I've got them from like when I graduated, when I got into uni, when I was 18, all that kind of stuff. Um, so I love those. This is the candle that I was on about. That's the Yankee Cappuccino Truffle Candle. I've then got a picture of me and my best friend with the really bad lighting. There we go. So there's a picture of me and my best friend there. Um, again, at Yanni's wedding. We were bridesmaids. So that's one of my favourite pictures. I've then got some teddies in the corner and then just things like jewellery and stuff. On the second shelf down, right, I've given up with the tripod. It's stressing me out. It's just going to live there. Um, so on the second, second shelf down, I have some pop figures up at the top. I've then got like photo albums down at the end. And then all the things I use on a night, um, like charging cables. These are all of my baking and cooking books. I've got my happiness planner. These two boxes are just things like DVDs and purses and stuff. I've got some more pop figures over in that corner. My Lumi alarm clock. Down here I have just books in general just kind of regular reading books and the things underneath there's things like nail varnishes and stuff like that so that's all pretty boring um and then you come back out we're going to ignore this part because it's a bit of a mess um but it's just the behind the door bit so i've got all of my things hung, hung up i've got my sakoni jolie's calendar up at the top and then i've got all of my dvds in this stand here um i'll also very quickly just spin back around to this wall um i don't really want to get too close because i don't want to show all the pictures that are in it but I have my photo frame here, which has loads of different pictures in. Um, they are from when I 
was at uni and I graduated, I am going to change them out so that they're um, a little bit different, a bit more relevant to my life now. Um, but I've then got these things hanging off them. So this is what Yanni included in her wedding invitations. So it's like a little pot of sand with the date of her wedding in, which I love and I still kept. And then I've also got these hanging hearts here, um, which my mum gave to me. So then going back to this bit, as I said, I've got all my DVDs here. These are the flowers that I used um, when I was a bridesmaid for Yanni. They're artificial, which means that we get to keep them. So they kind of just live on there. I've then got this little sign here that says a mermaid's welcome um, because I love mermaids. I then have this set of drawers here. So on the top, as you can see, it is crammed full of stuff. I really need to go through this. It was originally where I just had my perfumes because I've got all like my perfumes on here and stuff. Um, and then it kind of slowly got my skincare on there and then my skincare has exploded a little bit. So these are all the bits of skincare that I use on a morning um, and then also on a night as well. So I've got like my night balm and my night cream. I'm not going to go through the drawers, but basically it's full of extra toiletries, hair items. I've got my gym stuff in one drawer and I also have a candle drawer. I'm actually going to show my candle drawer because I just think it's really funny. So this is my candle drawer, which doesn't look like it. I have cookies on the top, um, but yeah. There is so many candles in there. Um, I've got like Neom, um, Yankee, these ones are Lily Flame. I've got some Bath and Body Works and yeah, some cookies. If I hide them in a drawer, I don't eat them. Next to that, I've then got this other set of drawers. This is my regular set of drawers, so it's got all of my clothes and bits in. On the top, I have not a lot of stuff really. I've got my TV. I'm watching So Connie Joel is at the moment. I'm just having a bit of a catch up. I've got two candles. I've then got most of my jewel rate which hangs up here um i've then got a little card here which i'm not going to zoom in on because again it's got um, a picture of someone on but that is what my friend gave me from her son alexander for the bits that i gave her when he was born and i just i love the card and um, it's got a little polaroid of him on so i just kind of leave that there on the bottom of my tv my true geekiness really shows so i have all of the disney princess figurines which you could get from um, which you got from Kinder Eggs quite a few years ago. I have all of them and they just kind of sit on my TV. I don't really want to get rid of them. Um, I do need to pack them away for when they come and take the pictures next week. But I just think they look really cute on there. I then got two of the some some teddies. So I've got the Little Mermaid one there. And this one is a Minnie Mouse one. Again, with all like my remotes and stuff. So all the boring crap. Um, I've then got my wardrobes in the corner here. This bit really annoys me though because how am I supposed to use this mirror? Like it's so small. Like I can move my curtains but still you've got to stand so close to the wall. So that's one thing I'm looking forward to in the new house. Being able to kind of move those. Then got all of my crap up at the top. So I've got like all of my swimwear in this round case. I've got wrapping paper, my regular case, all that kind of thing. Then have a little basket down here that's got all of my blankets in. So the two colourful ones you can see at the bottom are my mermaid blankets. I've then got just a regular black blanket on the top. It's where I chuck my clothes that I wear like after work and stuff and my handbags in there. That's just got like a little item in for the new house so I'm not going to go through that. I've then got my windowsill. Um, so this is what it looks like. It used to be really cluttered. Um, I've kind of done a lot better. So I've got a lot of pictures on there of me with like family um yeah it is actually just family there's none of me with like friends on there this is one of my favorite items in my room i actually bought it for the new house but i needed to get it out because i loved it and it's like a little terrarium um i haven't been able to buy a plant yet so it's got a candle in it at the minute but i do really like it got these i've got my little lego man a really nice clock there um which i really like this is one of my favorite pictures i went swimming with beluga whales um for my 18th birthday and then some more pictures. I've got a little lantern here that has um, lights inside. I might put a candle in it once I've got a plant for my terrarium. But for now, I really like that. And then my favourite part of my room is my little desk when it wants to focus again. Um, it's my little desk slash makeup area. I just love it. So I got this new chair. Um, it does have a throw over it because it's cream coloured. Let me just show you quick. So it's actually this colour. And it's got like the patterned back and stuff. So I got a throw just so that it wouldn't 
um, get dirty but I got that from home since just after Christmas and I love it. I've then got my Primark Gabriella um, cushion on there from her original range just because I think it looks really pretty. Okay yep so it's got that cushion on. Um, underneath I've just got things like this box that has all of the little pink box there it has all of my camera equipment in. I've got like my old laptop on there and things. The desk itself is still very messy i need to find homes for some of these things still um they're gifts and things that i've just got yes yeah, so if we ignore the messiness um i always have my laptop on there um it's where i do all my editing and things um i've then got like my diary and stuff on there as well so i know what videos i'm editing this box here has all these different drawers in and that's actually what homes all of my makeup i do need to go through that box and have a really really good clear out because some of the drawers are full and I need to kind of swap bits around and everything. Um, but yeah, that's what I use for now and I absolutely love it. Um, I then on top have all of my makeup brushes. So I'm using a mug from Anthropology for my face brushes. And then I'm actually using a Morphe brushes holder for my eye brushes. I just think it works really well. I've then got a little shot glass which has Jack Skeleton on it from Nightmare Before Christmas for my Q-tips. Um, which I find really handy when I'm doing makeup. And then I've got my little um, storage thing here with lipsticks in. So yeah, so I've got all those bits on the top there. I do really like how it's all like out at the moment. I then have a mirror on here. Um, the mirror is from HomeSense. I got it at the same time as the chair. Again, when it wants to focus, I do apologise. Um, but yeah, I really like it. It's not a silver mirror, but it's not like a gold mirror either. It kind of picks up on what's around it, which I think is really useful for things that you're kind of having in your room that changes a lot. I then on the bottom have my little logo sign that Yanni made me along with some little mermaid things. So this is the little mermaid glass and then I've got a little mermaid Lego thing. Two lipsticks that I need to be getting rid of um, because they don't suit me so I'm going to sell those and then just like a little photo frame and, and things like that. And then the last thing to show you is my bed. Now I do not like my bed. I feel like I was kind of forced into making the decision on it and I just don't like it. Um, not so much for the back of it, but for the end of it. These bits here get in the way so much. Um, but I mean, it does look nice. It was a good investment piece. So I've just got like this wooden bed, which has the purse on it. I've got fairy lights up on the back. I have a flower crown and a Minnie Mouse headband on one side. And then on the other side, I've got like my dream catcher, which I've had since I was like 10 or something stupid. Um, and then like some bows and stuff. This is the bedding I have on at the moment, which I do really like. Um, again, I'm gonna be have I'm gonna have to change this, but this bedding I got from Tesco. I can't remember what make it was, but it's a really comfy fleecy um, duvet set. It's white on one side with grey polka dots, and the other side is grey with white polka dots, um, as you can see on the cushions. And it's just really cozy for winter. And then I have my two cushions. One is a H, which I got for my birthday last week of my best friend. And then the other one says live, laugh, love, um, which is from Matalam. So yeah, that is everything that is in my bedroom. Um, again, I did that for selfish reasons. If you do want to fast forward through it, please do. But I did just do it so that I could look back on it and see kind of how my room has changed and things like that and how I used to have it um, at this point in my life. So I can't believe that it's 10 past 12. I've actually done everything that I needed to do so far today. And basically all I'm going to do now is I'm just going to finish up watching this YouTube video I'm then gonna go downstairs and have some lunch and then I'm gonna go to work. Hello again everyone so it's been a few hours Um, I didn't end up going out I got a text off my manager there we go Um, I got a text off my manager just so I was about to set off to say that we weren't having a meeting this week Um, so I just kind of stayed in then I had some lunch I've been through some more bits for the charity shop which are downstairs I've also been through some of like our old bits like we were clearing out the loft basically and we've got loads of like teddies and stuff to go through so I've been through all of those and I'm now currently sat at my desk and I've just uploaded the video for tomorrow I have done my thumbnail so I've edited uploaded done the thumbnail and I'm doing the tweets and everything now as well I haven't been out to the charity shops either as planned because as soon as I came back upstairs after being told that I don't need to go into work 
it just started pouring with rain. It, like the lighting looks quite good actually on camera and I don't know why because it's grey and miserable and it's chucking it down and it has been doing for the last like two and a half hours. It's just disgusting. Um, I was just going to get in the car really and take some bits over to the charity shop which is just, I mean it's only around the corner but they're really heavy bags so I can't carry them. Um, and it's just, I don't think it's going to be worth it. It's just too wet. So yeah, I don't really have much else kind of going on now for the rest of the day. My family's going to be home soon, especially my dad. Um, I'm going to go have a snack. I'm basically just going to do some more work now for the rest of the afternoon. I have nothing else exciting happening. So yeah, I'm going to leave the vlog here. Um, just so that I'm not rambling on about pointless crap that you don't need to know about and don't want to know about. Um, so I hope you have enjoyed this. Um, I'm not too sure when I'm next going to be vlogging, but you'll definitely be able to see me every Saturday at two o'clock with a brand new video on my channel. Little shameless self plug there. Um, but yeah, I'll see you soon with another video. Remember to like add me on social media and follow my blog and all of that stuff. And I will hopefully see you soon with another vlog, but if not, I will see you on a main channel video. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you're new as well. Bye. Mm -hmm.